It's been a while since I posted a video of a deck uh, that I've been showing. So I've decided to show a blue eye Dilver uh, with a lot of cards that are actually going out of standard on the 5th. So um, it's about time that you see it. I'm going to say which cards are still playable afterwards and which are not. Uh, so the standard blue eye Dilver. Uh, the win conditions are um, a uh, Geist of St. Traft and uh, Restoration Angel uh, with Rune Chanter Spike, of course. Um, a lot of instants that buff the Rune Chanter Spike, as you know, the, it gives um, first strike and uh, plus uh, X plus zero, where X is the number of uh, instants and sorceries in your graveyard. So it's pretty standard. Um, we have uh, four Delvers of Secrets. Um, yeah, that's one one of the rest of the win conditions. It flips whenever you reveal an instant or sorcery within your upkeep. Uh, so I've got four of those. Um, two gut shots. Uh, the gut shots are early removal. Uh, easy to get into the graveyard. Um, you discard them basically for um, two life. Um, four vapor snags. Again, um, that's pretty defensive. You can use them offensively as well. Uh, meaning uh, whenever you need uh, one more damage or two more damage, you just, uh, you know, if you have a pike uh, attached, you uh, Vapor Snack uh, an opposing creature, and you basically win. Four Ponders to go through your um, deck so that you can pull the necessary mana, because this, this deck plays only, only 20 mana cards. Um, so there are versions with uh, 19 as well. And the ponder uh, basically allows you to look at the at the top three cards, put them back in any order and draw. But before you draw, you can shuffle. So if you don't like them, you can get others. The Gaitaxian Probe um, gives you, again, to draw a card and to actually know what you can expect from your opponent um, based on, uh, you know, revealing his hand. Uh, this one's going out of standard uh, on the fifth. Uh, it's from New Phyrexia. And the gut shot is as well. The vapor snag is also going out of uh, standard because it's from the same set. The ponder is from uh, core set 12, so 2012, so it's going out of standard. Then we've got thought scour, um, which is um, not going out of standard. Um, this one uh, mills uh, two cards from uh, any um, player's deck. Uh, you use it for yours, so you can mill, mill instant and sorceries and go, pile, uh, go through your deck faster. And it also gives you a chance to draw a card. Um, then we have uh, the three uh, Rune Chanter Spikes. Uh, four Mana Leaks, that's also going out of standard. Uh, a Spectral Flight, now this is actually to protect your Geist of St. Traft, because uh, this is your ultimate win condition. Um, so, you know, uh, there are a lot of ways to, to protect it in this deck, but uh, the, the Spectral Flight makes it a flyer, plus 2-2. Two, two. And then 4 Snapcaster Mages, so you can replay all of your instants and sorceries in your graveyard. Um, 3 Geists of St. Traft, and I don't play 4 simply because I don't have 4, otherwise I would be playing 4. And 4 Restoration Angels, um, those allow you to flicker your Geists, flicker your Snapcaster Mage, play another instant when it, when it comes back. Um, you know, basically, uh, they add um, a level of control uh, on top of the control that you already have. Uh, then there are um, four sea crown coasts, four glacial fortresses, two moorland hounds, so that you can, you know, create flyers uh, out of the creatures that you've lost somehow. One uh, planes, and that's uh, because of the Restoration Angels to, you know, to um, balance the mana base. Uh, and the rest is all um, islands, and that makes nine islands. All right, um, now let's look at the sideboard. Uh, I basically have a Surgical Extraction. Um, this works, uh, you know, pretty well against zombies, against uh, monogreen... Um, Rancor Infect, uh, uh, Blue Green Rancor Infect, um, it's pretty, pretty decent card. Works against most decks. One Oblivion Ring. Uh, again, this this one is uh, mostly against control. Um, well, you can you, you can find use for it in different situations. I pl play two Marrow Shards 
and the sideboard, and those are going out of standard. Um, they do one damage to each attacking creature, and I use them to um, kill invisible stalkers. Uh, one dissipate, this one is against control as well. Three timely reinforcements. I play those against zombies pretty often. Um, one dismember that used to be main board uh, and got replaced by the spectral flight. And that's again going out of standard as well as the timely reinforcements. Uh, Divine offerings, this one destroys an artifact and it's an instant. Um, you also gain life equal to its mana cost. Um, two revoke existences. Uh, both Revoke Existence and Divine Offering going out of standard. Um, revoke Existence is a sorcery and destroys artifact and enchantment. And three Celestial Purges and those are uh, entirely for zombies. Um, mostly, I don't think there's a card in here that's actually staying in standard. So, uh, all of this going out of standard on the 5th. But still, this this um, deck is pretty strong so there, there's going to be a standard version again. Just a lot of cards have to be replaced with uh, with what's new right now. Alright, thank you guys, see you later.